Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I don't know why I said it like that, but we're gonna leave it. Anyway, I don't know where the months are going. And it's September, so let's talk about what I plan on reading in September. So one thing that's kind of exciting is that one of my classes is called Resources for Children. And every so often, we get to choose the book that we're gonna read. Typically they're children's books, young adult, could be whatever. So my next class that I have, which is the week after Labor Day because I don't have classes on Labor Day, I have to choose a children's book or a graphic novel. And I knew immediately what I was gonna get. I wanted to do a graphic novel. I love graphic novels. Uh, and so I knew exactly what I wanted to choose. So I've been wanting to read the Wings of Fire series in graphic novels for so long and I'm finally going to do that. So I chose the Dragonette Prophecy, which is the first Wings of Fire book. And I'm really excited for this because my nieces, I have a couple nieces that love this series, love these books. So I'm super excited. I was actually going to read one this summer when I was on vacation with them, I had my sister bring one along and I just never got around to it. And so I'm really, really excited to actually finally be able to read these and kind of bond with my nieces a little bit by reading them. Anyway, I don't really know what this series is about except that there are seven uh, like dragon tribes or something who are at war with each other. So I'm not 100% sure, but I'm really excited. Um, Fun fact, my niece can recite the dragon prophecy um, and I have a video of it, which is really cute. So I'm excited. That's gonna be, hopefully, it's not gonna be the first book that I read in September, but it's probably gonna be read as soon as I can get my hands on it, which is hopefully gonna be tomorrow from the public library. So I put it on hold and I should pick it up before my class tomorrow. While we're on the topic of my class books, Let's go to the next book, which is going to be Res Dogs, which is actually a new book from this year, 2021. And all I know is that it is this young girl, she's Malian, but she is living with her grandparents on a uh, Wabanaki reservation. So I'm not 100% sure what's gonna happen, what it's really about, but I'm very excited. That is a book that we um, actually have to read. So it's a children's book. And I think it's only like 180 pages or so. It should be, so it should be a really quick read, which is exciting, but it sounds very interesting. So that will be probably read later on in the month of September. But those are the two books that I have to read for class. Those are my required readings. Um, very excited about both of them. I love this class. I think it's so fascinating and it's just, it's a lot of fun. So moving on to the books that I plan to read. This is gonna be very short. <laughs> the first book I'm gonna be reading, and I'm actually gonna start it later today, today is August 31st, um, is the Zodiac Academy. So the first Zodiac Academy book I am going to be reading tonight, and we're gonna see how it goes. I really don't know much about it. I just know that it is an elemental magic school or academy. Um, kind of that blood magic and that it's kind of like adult Harry Potter, which is what grabbed my eye. I also have a friend who read it and is obsessed with it and she's been like waiting for me to start it. So I'm finally starting it and I'm excited to see how it goes. I have really high hopes for the series. Um, the only thing is that they're like 600 plus pages every book and there's six of them out. So because of that, I do want to try to get through all six of them this month. It's probably not going to happen. But if I need a refresher or something to kind of like a palate cleanser just to get my, I don't know if I'm in a slump or something from reading so much, um, I do plan on trying to read All Adults Here by Emma Straub. I don't know much about this book. I got it as a Secret Santa gift um, this past year. It seems like a family centered book with secrets that are being surfaced and parenting and it's supposed to have a little bit of humor with it, but also like heartwarming, I believe. So we'll see how this goes. This will be my little palate cleanser if I need to kind of just take a break from a dense series. Um, so we'll see. This is one that I would hope to get to, but we'll see. And then of course, as always, I would love to get to my book of the month, whatever book that is that I will choose. 
and I will be choosing that tomorrow. So anyway, those are my September choices for this month. I'm very looking forward to the classroom picks. I'm also really looking forward to the Zodiac Academy. So it's going to be hopefully a really good month and it's going to be, yeah, it's going to be really good. I'm really looking forward to it. I have read 47 books as of today out of my goal of 50, which is crazy. So um, I might up it to 70. My goal is going to be 70 books. We have how many months left? September, October, November, December. We have four months left. If I can get about 20 more books, ooh, 70 might be pushing it. We'll see though. No, I think I can do it, especially with the books that I have to read for class. Okay, 70 is my goal. As of now, we're going to try to get there. That's exciting. Um, 47 books is also the most I've ever read in an entire year. The most I've read before that was like 28 or 29. And I thought that was really high. Um, and I've already doubled that. Although my sister's already at 133 for the year. I don't know how she does it. I don't know how any of you who do it that read that much. I would love to be able to do that, but I can't. <laughs> so I'm really proud of 47 and I'm going to try to get it to 70, which is crazy. It's a very high number of books. Um, so we're going to see if I can get there. I think it would be awesome. Anyway, that's it for this video. Very short, sweet to the point. What book are you looking forward to reading the most in September? Give me some recommendations. Like what are you reading? I want to know. Anyway, I hope you guys have a fantastic week and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.